Under the large tent, Logar Governor Atikula Lodin and his advisors listened to local elders from the Kerwar Bowl, something that until recently was thought to be unrealistic. Uh, seven months ago, we, we couldn't even consider putting forces in here yet. Now we're here with a, uh, a full company-sized element that's been here for uh, well over a month. Um, we're executing projects. Um, we've uh, conducted security operations uh, to uh, I increase security in Kerwar. And today I think we had 53, between 53 and 58 elders from uh, the Kerwar Bowl. Uh, this leadership was willing to come in here and talk to this group right here. That couldn't have happened 90 days ago. So it's been a lot of work. On the surface, it may not seem like that big of a deal, but uh, for Afghanistan, I think that's huge. After hearing several of the leaders address their concerns and offer suggestions regarding security and their local government, Governor Ludin states his objectives and highlights the efforts of the soldiers who are improving the quality of life for the villagers in this area. These ISAF people that have come here are just like you guys. They have children just like you. They have families just like you. They have sons like you. They have daughters like you. These ISAF soldiers have traveled 10,000 kilometers to come and defend you and your nation. Please help and allow the ability for this country to be constructed and built. Please allow for roads to be built. This is a destitute country, a destitute province, a destitute district. Let's use this assistance so that we can gain the benefit of us for our nation and our future. The governor understands what our plan is, and we understand more importantly what the govern governor's plan is and, and support it. He emphasized that we're not the bad guys here. We're here. We've come from our families. We've come from our, our lifestyle, our children. We've come here to help the Afghan people. The governor was uh, emphasized that point quite a lot, and that, and, that, and that was good. It's through meetings like the Mega Shura that villagers and the government can acquire a better understanding of each other's goals, paving the way for a safer and more prosperous Afghanistan. Reporting for Task Force Spartan, I'm Army Sergeant Rob Frazier.